So now we will learn how can we import multiple prepaid lines in black line through Excel, not instead of going and entering one by one data, which is very time consuming. So you can see this import option. We will not use import option. If you we'll use import option, it will group all the lines and you will see only one line here. And instead of that, we will use multiple. So let's click on multiple. By clicking multiple, this window has opened. Now what is saying? Our Excel sheet should have a start date, end date, amount, open date, close date, description. These five columns, these six columns are mandatory. Okay. Here you can see origination, origination date, open date, these two date. When you upload Excel file, these two date will not be considered. Further, yeah, we have to select the method. In this, we have to select the state method because we will not be putting all the amortization schedule uh, for every month. So system automatically calculate. So we will put originating date in our Excel file only. Same with here description is asking. We'll just put triple dot because this description will not have any such effect. Now I'm going to open the Excel file. This is the Excel file. Here we mention description, amount. Then after these three column will be specific. We'll not change anything. The yellow highlighted are the one we have to change. The mandatory fields are description, amount, open date, originating date, start in this for uh, open date, start date, end date, and originating date. Rest fields are optional, but we have to mention in reference, we'll mention invoice number, offsetting account number. Then, after offsetting account number, should be your expense, expense zero number to which expense it is being offsetting to. Then account code. These are optional. Which you want to fill. Once you fill this, we'll go back to our data. We'll click on browse. Then we'll go and select our file. Once it is selected, the data will come down. Now it is has been selected. Just check here. You can see upload our Excel file only had one sheet upload. So it is showing that upload. Let's say you are working with multiple uh, entity. Then you can create multiple for multiple entity. You can create multiple sheet here and you can work uh, upload in one go. Start date in there. Just check your mapping is correct. And whatever column is not in your file, it was so as use above means it will not take any data here it will blank come down you can see your data here just click on it go to data come on top and click on import it will take some time to load once loaded you will be back to the front page and here you can see start date the date you mentioned in date the main date you mentioned everything is here invoice number description reporting balance balance so you can use this import Excel format for importing data for prepaid reconciliation in black line, which is more simpler than putting one by one. Signing off, Asis Sanara. Bye.